Judgment and discernment are in contrast of each other, and there are many definitions of both. Judgment is defined as the act of judging or assessing a person or situation or event. It is also defined as the cognitive process of reaching a decision or drawing a conclusion. The mental ability to understand and discriminate between relations. The capacity to assess situations or circumstances shrewdly and to draw sound conclusion. An opinion formed by judging something. Judgment and criticism is reacting from fear, often related to the behavior of others. On the deepest level, it stems from a longing for recognition, appreciation, and or validation. In judgment, our pain is about what others are doing, not doing, being, not being, and it has been judged, criticized as bad, wrong. It often has a lot of a story attached to it as well. Judgment has a sort of, this is the final answer feeling, which closes us off to receptivity and the possibility of mutual understanding. Discernment is defined as the ability to make a smart judgment about something, the cognitive condition of someone who understands, the mental ability to understand and discriminate between relations, the trait of judging wisely and objectively, perception of that which is obscure. Discernment, on the other hand, is responding from love rather than reacting, so we can make an appropriate choice for ourselves and for the good of others. In discernment, we are aware that we are never completely known or claim that our perspective is the only truth. And while this is subtle and challenging to our ego, it is very important as it might change how we relate to a situation. Spiritual discernment is the ability to distinguish between truth and deception on the spiritual path. In Sanskrit, discernment is called viveka and is said to be the crowning wisdom of the spiritual path, allowing us to discover what is real versus unreal. The Indian sage Patajali believed that it was spiritual discernment that helped us achieve a luminous state also known as spiritual illumination or oneness. Embodiment is an excellent tool for recognizing if we're coming from judgment or discernment. Focus on what you feel. If you feel heavy, distraught, angry, you may be approaching it with judgment. However, if you feel light or even if it's a hard situation, curious, compassionate, you're likely approaching it from discernment. And again, if you notice you're creating a large and endless narrative around the situation in which you are right and the other is wrong, you know you're in judgment. Finally, you always have a choice. So choose wisely. Join us live Friday night for another fascinating discussion on these topics and more. Thanks for watching.